One of the benefits of membership of the institution is that it will, they will literally hand hold you through the process of becoming a chartered environmentalist or a chartered en engineer. In my head, rightly or wrongly, you're not, you're not a, a, a true professional engineer until you're chartered. I think the reason I want to be uh, professionally registered is because it kind of gives you a sort of a measuring yardstick for what you should be like as an engineer. Data does show us that, that registered engineers will earn more money during their career than, than non-registered. Once you've graduated, that's your academic qualifications. Registration is then looking at the, uh, is a professional qualification, so it's looking at the work-based competency they have. And it, it's re really important, um, especially these days, you know, the job market is very competitive, and I think those that have, have started to look at professional registration will fare better in the jobs market than those who wouldn't. Let me give you an example from our company. So Class globally employs more than 1,000 engineers and they can be in any one of our 14 factories around the world in North America, uh, in China, India, but mainly Germany, France and Hungary. And in order to get a role as a class uh, engineer, whether that's design engineering or field engineering, uh, you would certainly need the qualification. But having a professional registration really, really helps because, of course, uh, there's an international barrier there, there's a language barrier, and it proves that uh, you are of a certain uh, standard to be that member. And I think a, a British one in particular carries a lot of weight globally, uh, and that can only really help uh, people today if they're looking to expand their careers. The institution are fantastic in saying, OK, this is your career, let us help you apply for chartership and they will take you through step by step. You might not realise that what you're doing is actually relevant and appropriate for those different um, chartership bodies. And the institution have lots of experience of this so they can help you through and it is a hand-holding process. So I'm a chartered environmentalist through IAGRI. In advance of getting that, they assigned me a mentor um, who was just unbelievably helpful, helped me structure the application, prepped me for the interview. And I agree, are like a family. They, if you want to do something, they will throw resources at it to try and make it a reality. And that's, that's my experience, and that's why I've, I'm still with I agree, really. I think I read about chartership when I was 16 or 17 and I was looking at studying engineering and the way I read it and took it on board was you're not really an engineer until you're chartered and I don't know if that's really true but that's what's been in my head since I was that sort of age and it's it'll be a big accomplishment when I get it done. Whether you become an incorporated engineer or a chartered engineer or a fellow, it's a kind of a, a recognition of your career path and that, that's quite important to me so it says something about me and where I've come from and what I'm doing. It gives you a set of lines that you actually follow and try and you know, adhere to and it, it raises your game and it makes you think deeply about what you're doing and I value that. As part of my uh, sort of joining of the IAGRI, one of the things that I wanted to do now was proper professional registration, um, and uh, they have been really helpful in getting me set up and mentoring me through that process. For me, my, my original goal was always to get chartered. For, for me, I wouldn't want to go with it for, for, with any other institution for that. Um, I don't think I would get the same support anywhere else for, for one. The title engineer is very misused um, and it's been argued about for years, you know, the person who comes and fixes your washing machine calls himself an engineer. So professional registration does give you some professional credibility, it means you are a professional practicing engineer and there's some kudos attached to that.